Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Card Lounge. Today I'm going to show you how to make a customized curtain wall. So in case you have a design that you want to do but it's not in your library setting for your windows, um, you can actually create your own um, windows. So right now I have this open space and I kind of want to do something amazing with it. I want to put a, like a very big uh, curtain wall that wraps around the door and goes with the, the the design I'm going with so when I open an elevation that um, faces this face you can see it better and so I'm going to draw out with lines and curves the shape of the window that I want so you can pretty much design any window you want in Archicad any shape any anything you want so here I'm going to start by um, designing first the wall, the hole we call it a wall hole for window and I want my window to look like very realistic so I'm going to put some transforms and some framework so you just do whatever you want to do but if you want it to look more realistic think about how it would get built and kind of do it like that because most glass comes in panels so kind of create some panels and also create the frame with which the the window the glass would sit in so I'm pretty much done with that so I'm going to select the circles and the the lines that I used and make a control G that groups them up and yeah and then I'm going to go back into this window because this is a 3d window and I'm going to paste it here control V command V and yeah there you have it now I'm going to use a slab to kind of give it a 3d form I'm going to choose the material my slab I want it to be glass and I'm going to make it um, a blue color so that you can see that so this is where my glass is going to be um, where you see certain times certain corners are not closed so make sure you always close those corners and then after that you can also create for your frame I'm going to make mine aluminum and um, also just change its properties so that it works for you and then um, I'm also going to see its thickness and its height from the glass so you can choose whatever you want but I kind of at this point wanted it to kind of be uh, flashing in the middle this is before I put it in the rest of the frame and now I'm going to put it in the rest of the frame um, yeah so with that you can kind of see if I go to the down to the 3d all in 3d you can kind of see how it's going to look and that small hole there is where the door is going to be uh, we are not yet finished you have to make the wall hole so choose the total outline of the of of the window and then uh, put it right over the whole window using the materials of the frame and then you're going to go to properties and you're going to change its name and the classification and you're going to call it wall hole it's very important that you write it like that otherwise you'll have a gap when you put your window on so we have done that and then we can go ahead and save those properties and now we can select everything that we have made and then we're gonna go to file we're gonna go down to libraries and we're going to choose um, a window option and we're gonna save it whatever name you want to save it and that's all you have to do it saves those properties the way you have saved it and then after that you go to windows and you just click it where you want it it's facing outside and voila there you have it you have your window and it's as beautiful as you want it to be thank you for watching stay tuned for more episodes please remember to subscribe and like and share this video with as many people as you want